All right, what's up everybody? Um, drop out here. Welcome back to part two of this mini series, I guess you could call it. Make sure to like and comment and subscribe. It would be much appreciated. I am doing a giveaway at 250 subs. If you watched the previous video, you know that, but if you're new to this video, then I'm letting you know. Um, also, do comment if you want to see more of this, because I'll do more cars and we'll just completely strip them down and do it from scratch. And um, yeah, I mean, I enjoy doing it. And if you guys like the content, let me know. Um, it would help out a lot. But um, so we're doing the Tempest Magnum right here. So far, we fixed up the body. We stripped it all down, all the parts, and we got about half the engine done. There's still a few things we have to do, like the clutch and air filter and whatnot. But um, I say we jump right into it and see how far we can get. Hopefully, this is the last part of this little series, and I'm excited to see how it turns out. Um, but let's go ahead and keep building this engine. So I'm going to just start out a part mount. Go to the tablet just to see what we stopped at. I think mean, we're already about that. Uh, I am filming this back to back, so hopefully you just watched the previous video like literally five seconds ago and hopped onto this one. Uh, if you're new on this video, I mean, if it's your first time here watching this video, I suggest going to the first one to see what we did. If not, it's cool. Do you? Um, two, four, six, eight. So we need 16 of these rock arms. And on this video, we're starting at $32,000. So let's see how much we spend. Because this engine is pretty expensive. And we still have tires and rims to buy. Those could get pretty expensive as well. Eight spark plug. Yeah, the engine is the most, I want to say time consuming because like I said in the last video, there's just so many components to engines, especially an engine like this. Um, go back to car parts here, get water pump, apply that. <clears throat> what do you look? Oh, next, I think that's where we get this. Yep. Um, I also do want to see. You know. Already got spark plugs. <coughs> <coughs> the air filter. This tunes up a lot, so I'm going to go ahead and buy those from here. And the rocker arms are just normal. 16 rock arms, right? Hopefully it's 16. If not, I just wasted a hundred dollars. Water pump in. But if you guys don't know what this game is, hopefully I'm showing you kind of what it's about. It's pretty fun. Um, I like simulation games, so you can kind of expect it for me. But not everyone likes games like this, you know. Some people are just sports games, or some people are more the action or first-person shooters. I like it all, to be honest with you. That's why it makes it very versatile, what um, games I buy. But, finish up this side of the rocker arm. I do need a flywheel too, and an engine head cover. I'm not sure if the engine head covers can be bought from the tuning shop, like how all of these are. I'm sure the air scoop can. These spark plugs. You know, also, if you want to see me stream some of this content, I would be down to stream this too. That would be pretty fun. Then you could literally see the whole process, no speeding up and and whatnot. Well, we're almost done with this engine and we could put this bad boy in. What I might do though before I put the engine is is actually do all the suspension first. Just so it's done. Not sure if I already 
but go ahead and get this. That did that. We need a flywheel. Mm, that's expensive. I'm not gonna do that. And let's get flywheel. Oh, it was only a hundred more. Whatever. Uh, we need two of these. Right? Cover A, cover B. Oh, okay. Good thing I didn't buy two. But engine cover B. Engine cover A. There it is. Your scoop. Luckily, it's nice and chrome from here. This store, I mean. And the water pump equally. Yep, put on the engine cover B. Also, there is like skill points in this game, so as you can see, I'm screwing decently fast. Um, when I started out, it was not like that. Um, I spent a lot of time trying to upgrade all that because screwing is like the main main part of this game. Get this flywheel in. Need a clutch plate. I might have one. I'll put it for this. Pressure plate. Don't have that. Yeah, I apologize for my voice. I was sick last week and my vo I lost my voice like a few days ago. So it's been raspy. Um, oh, look it. So I do have... 10 skill points. I'm going to go ahead and upgrade the screwing. <clears throat> and I guess I'll do the mounting speed. And that's all I could do. Hopefully that helped a lot though. Dirt mount. Um, go to the tablet. Need this electronic shop, get the ignition wires. Clutch release bearing, don't have that. Go ahead and buy that real quick. I don't think the tune shop has any of that. Okay, yeah. As I stated in the uh, first video, the tune shop basically adds horsepower like through these parts. That's why they're so shiny too. And um, that's basically how we're going to up the horsepower. I think it was like 325 to start with. And um, after we do the dyno shop when the car is done, you'll see it'll make a big difference <clears throat> in horsepower. But then again, I'm not sure how much, because I've never done this. Uh, ripping a car completely and rebuilding, so. The serpentine belt, we do have a little clip here. Those are hard to, hard to uh, I should say easy to miss. They're so tiny and you can't see and you're like, why can't this car drive and whatnot, so. We need a radiator fan. I'm not sure if the tune shop will have that. Let's go ahead and see. Nope. Doesn't do much for us, so. There we go. <clears throat> As you can see, though, all the little screws, everything is all, all like, realistic. So that's cool. That's why I like it. Um, I do know... I'm going to have to go ahead and rotate this because all these little caps are easy to miss. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there's also these, which is very hard to see. <clears throat> go ahead and I don't think. Yeah, just in the car parts. All right, eight of these. And three of these. Let's 
Sorry if I stop talking here and there too because I get really focused in this game. Honestly, like when I'm hungover or something, this game is perfect because it's like the perfect like anxiety reliever. <laughs> but um Yeah, it just makes your mind like you just really have to focus on what you're doing. It's really weird. Would be cool as a VR version of this game. I'm not sure if there is or not. I haven't done any like research on that, but that would be pretty dope. Right, then let's put this last little uh, cap on here. And we should be done other than the oil pan. <clears throat> and one more here. And I think the engine is done. Yeah, am I missing anything? Doesn't seem like it. As I said, it's pretty easy to miss stuff like that little ass clip right there, but we got it. <clears throat> I think the engine is done. If you ask me, that's a pretty dope ass looking engine. But let's go ahead and back here. And like I said, I'm going to leave that for now. Because I want to do the suspension before we put the engine in. But let's get into it. Alright, so. I'm not sure what parts I fixed. I know I did fix some parts, but. <clears throat> not all of them. Oh! Forgot to do this and show you guys. I can't fix brake stuff too. Oh! But I don't have any. I probably sold them on accident. I always forget to do the brakes. That's fine. The brakes are fairly cheap. So we'll just go ahead and stick everything on here that I fixed. Okay, I need two bushings. Let's see, what can I. Oh, here we go. So one, two, three, four. One, two. Yeah, okay. I had to do like math in my head for a second there. <clears throat> What's the right? Oh. Alright, it says 12 rubber bushings. I'm probably gonna need at least 10. So I'm just gonna get 10 for now. Put this bad boy in. Shock absorber. Let's do these. Actually, I want to be. Okay, yeah. So I can do some suspension, but what is it? Oh, and brakes. <laughs> okay. So all these stuff I can tune because we're gonna we're trying to build a fast car here. Um, but for now I'm just gonna stick to this. I need two of these. We have twenty eight thousand should be enough. But I need the springs and the cap. That'll be hard. I don't think I could fix that, you know. Two of these for the front wheels. I think I could do the brake discs here. Oh, guess not. <clears throat> Do these. Doing wreck, I don't have. I remember I damaged that. Right, so. I already bought those. Oof, 800 just for that. I should have plenty of money though. 
play bar. Fire rods. Okay, so I need two of these, one of those. Let's do this. This part actually could get pretty difficult just because it's hard to see like some of the parts like the shocks are sold separately and I don't know if the springs are different but we're about to find out. And two of these. And two of those. I just want to get these out of the way because I'm already here and then I'll go ahead and look for the uh, shocks. This is part of rebuilding now, I guess. <clears throat> Lots of tedious, tedious things. Right, let's put the front steering. I don't have one of these. My list is growing because I'm too lazy to uh, delete them, but I'm, I am trying to go as fast as I can for you guys. Just so you can see what's going on. Need one of those. Some of them I didn't break when I was trying to fix them. They actually just um I think it's like 15. If it's under 15 or 20%, you can't fit they're not fixable. So basically um you you just you're forced to buy some part parts anyways. Oh my gosh, I just... Buy this. Break this, have that. I'll have the brake pads. Did I buy the wheel hook bearings? Yes, I did. Wheel hook cap, I don't have. I need two of these, I believe. Let's go back to the other side. Put that one on. Okay, there's two there. And let's check this out. Yep, I need one more. <clears throat> I also need two more rubber bushings. You see? So I'm going to go ahead and get these. And put them in right here. <clears throat> okay, let's go over here. What I'm gonna do after I finish at least this front suspension, I'm gonna see where we're at in time and then um I mean if it goes into a third video then that should be it because after that it's mostly just body stuff and painting and testing it out, so um Let's see my inventory. And then I need... That, okay, so... How do I clear search? Here we go. Double wish phones, shock absorber. I think it's just the front spring. Okay, so let's get two of these. And I think it's... I think it's two of these. Hopefully. We're gonna find out right now. Uh, where am I? I'm over here to our spring puller. Yep, perfect. <clears throat> Going this one up. Now we should be over able to go back here, part mount, and fix this. Yep, perfect. Do this one. Need at least two brake pads.
And I do have two calipers that I got salvaged from when I fixed them. So, should be good with that. Can't do the wheels yet because we gotta buy some new ones. Put this brake pad on. And this caliper. Caliper. Okay. And now. We do have rear out axle. Don't have these. I'm gonna get two of these real quick. Can I buy them from the tuning shop? Not that you absorb. <clears throat> You hurt me so much that I had to leave you. Girl, I forgot you were tired. We'll be perfect together. But you hurt me so much that I had to leave you. Alright guys, so what I did is basically sped up the end there because I saw the time we were at. Um, trying to make these videos not too long. Um, I also am trying to go as fast as I can, but like I said before, it's really tedious work. But um, So basically we finished all the suspension, so next we're going to just have to buy the exhaust, put in like the coolant and um, you know fuse box battery, all that stuff and uh pop the engine in do some body work so i think we'll be done next video um but if you stuck around this long thanks for watching really appreciate it make sure to hit that subscribe button and um hopefully i have this next video up after this one so then you could just watch all three um back to back but i don't like edit editing really long videos so uh there you have it, and uh, we'll finish this Tempest um, in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.